Illinois legislators missing their budget deadline for the third year in a row after they failed to meet their July 1st target date. So Illinois, not the only state running without a budget. What could this mean for everyday citizens there? With more Fox Business's Tracy Carrasco. Tracy. Good morning, ladies. Now, as you said, uh, as of July 1st, there are more than 10 states operating without a budget, sending them into full or partial shutdown mode. They are Connecticut, Delaware, Illinois, Maine, Massachusetts, New Jersey, Oregon, Rhode Island, and Wisconsin. In Pennsylvania and Michigan, the budget has passed the legislature and is on the governor's desk. In Illinois, the state is now in its third year without a budget, but in a stunning development on Sunday, House Republicans broke with Governor Bruce Rauner and voted to approve tax increase and spending bills, much like the ones passed earlier with bipartisan support in the Senate. The new bills will be voted on today there. The governor threatens a veto because he wants the tax hike to expire after four years. The tax hike is expected to generate $5 billion. Republicans who voted for the tax increase say while they hated to do it, Illinois has already spent the money and they fear a credit downgrade. We have gone far too long without a meaningful solution for Illinois that brings back jobs, that provides property tax relief, that balances a budget. That's what we're going to continue down that effort. We started that past several months ago. We've got a great blueprint to work on. I'm glad to see that the Senate and the House Democrats are trying to bring things over. I'm, I'm hopeful today that we can bring about a solution. Meanwhile, in New Jersey, the state is under the second shutdown in its history after the legislature controlled by Democrats failed to reach an agreement by midnight Friday, their deadline. Republican Governor Chris Christie ordered the shutdown of non-essential services like the DMV and state parks, unfortunately just in time for the holiday weekend. Maine is also under a partial shutdown, and in Wisconsin, their budget deal fell apart over how to fix and improve crumbling roads. All right, Tracy, so what happens if a state like Illinois ultimately fails in passing a budget. You know, they have a lot of work to do. Uh, colleges, universities uh, from, funded by the state, they could lose some of their financial aid. Roads might not be fixed. Uh, Powerball sales, as we saw, have been halted temporarily, I guess, until they can work out the budget, until they can figure out how to pay the winners. Well, the pressure is certainly on. Absolutely, yes. Tracy, thank you very much.